Happy Holidays, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Merry Kwanzaa, all the good stuff. It is Eric, back at it again. Um, with an update video, mainly because I haven't had the time to do anything special. Mainly because I feel like that's the best way to summarize up how this update video is going to go. Um, once again, gonna be like last year, no jokes or comedy bits or anything like that. I couldn't plan this out, and obviously I couldn't plan it out because it's not even March. It's at the end of the year, so I might as well do it here right before the whole thing starts. Um, okay. Um, unscripted as usual. Um, okay, so if I was going to talk about anything right now, it's mostly that I got two videos coming up and or being uploaded as soon as this video drops. Like, this one's going to come up first, then I have two of my animatics coming out right afterwards. Um, one of them is going to be silent because it's basically just a proof of concept and it was for a portfolio piece. That was the one that was actually working the longest on. That's why the second one that I have scheduled that is audio based that should be coming out soon is also uh, coming out now. It could have came out a lot sooner if I had enough time, but things have been changing and happening around. I think one of the biggest problems that's been happening is that during the entirety of this summer, I changed from my previous uh, full-time job to a new full-time job. And that's good because I'm making um, a better f uh, cash and funding. It's one of the reasons why one of the big things that's probably going to go up on the Instagram main website and even the comic book website and even my DeviantArt um, is going to be a bunch of new colored pieces and whatnot. Actually, I have a lot of uh, properly illustrated stuff coming out at some point. So that'll be fine. But um, yeah, it's been basically since last... Or actually, sorry. Since May of this year, I have basically started a new job and I have been working almost so diligently with it because it's been like a almost t 10 to 12 hour shifts almost every day. Like I'm only now getting a break because recently my entire team actually just quit on me. So interesting. Kind of puts me in a place where I don't really know what my work is going to be like considering that your entire team quits on you and you don't know what you're going to do. Because I don't know if I'm still going to be at this job or I'm going to shift to another full-time job at a different place or even go back to a previous employer. But what I would say for now is I am super happy because depending on whichever one I'm going to be uh, statusing up, depending on where this full-time job goes, I'm pretty much just going to go right back to what I was doing previously and it'll be just easier to get back to work on it. The main reason why the first this entire summer was kind of difficult was besides going out of town and seeing some family members and traveling and all that stuff it was also um like just work made it impossible to keep up with it i mean i did do catch up work for animations and storyboards since then and to be fair i don't really know when i started the silent animatic that's going to be coming up on the website here soon but that one was uh basically 198 slides that one is probably the biggest one i've done the only one besides that is the most recent mike burn fire zach fights a dragon or zach and mike fight a dragon but yeah in any case i have some other uh projects still lined up um i kind of sad that the youtube uh channel didn't pop off as much this year although to be fair that's also because I've been working on some other side projects. Actually, I guess I could say this now because we're going to be probably uploading it soon. But congratulations, or no, I shouldn't say congratulations. I should say get ready because one of the big things coming up this year is that I'm actually going to be making a separate gaming channel. Not because I want to make gaming content like a Let's Play. I'm going to be doing something more of like an edited Let's Play in a sort of way. But it'll be with me and my buddy Chris, actually. And that one's going to be a lot of fun because uh, the first one we have set up, we have both live action bits, some uh, drawn bits that I have to work on. I got to edit a picture here soon. But basically, a lot of stuff coming up with that one more in particular. Uh, that'll be on a separate sub channel, though. That won't be on the main one. My main channel is still just going to be my animatics and artwork because it, I also use that for professional stuff. And. Honestly, if they're going to hear some of the unhinged stuff I say on the channel, that's definitely going to ruin some stuff. So I think when I uh, inevitably show off that secondary channel, I'll go ahead and make like a YouTube video showing it. And then I don't know what I'll name it. I kind of want to call it 
Burning Swordsman Studios has been the tagline name for my studio for like the longest time and it's always just been that, but on God, I don't think that's very representative of the gaming night or won't be a good title for the gaming channel, mainly because also it will probably be partially ran by me and my buddy Chris. Mostly because me and him live close enough to each other we've been working together on the project, so that'll be fun. I think overall though, uh, everything's still kind of like on the main course. I'm just kind of sad that my projects haven't been coming out as fast as I wanted to. I haven't had the time to work on a lot of them. And also I've been shifting from different project ideas. Like I will admit one thing I actually do feel kind of, oh my God, I'm scratching two feet. One thing I do kind of admit that I feel bad about is I was working on some animatics based on some audio recordings from me and my friends playing D&D. I don't know if I'll still have enough time to work on those, but those were still some ones I still eventually want to get to at some point, but I might have to put them on the back burner. Mainly because I'm actually also going to be announcing that I'm doing a, um, I got two big projects because one of them is since I've recently come into a lot more money because of my uh, full-time job and everything, I'm going to actually try and pursue a different project on the sidelines actually and that is i'm turning one of my comics uh on my website by the way uh legion into a video game i'm uh, gonna go full frontal on that um i've actually been working on that quite a bit in some of the conceptual phases but i've been getting enough help from people here and there volunteering and whatnot to assist with it which has been awesome um we haven't gotten to a full demo yet but i will say that when i actually do make a full demo of it um we'll probably try and do some either crowdfunding and maybe just find some sort of way to get the extra cash for it but i've been mostly uh, spending my own personal money getting the uh, project together and i know a lot of people here and there have like asked to work on it too but like the real ones have actually been like uh putting some definite great help on it uh one of the first things i want to do as uh, the project develops is mostly put it towards a more of a mechanical game. Like it'll be mostly mechanics. It's gonna be an RPG, but it's gonna have uh, maybe more in-depth combat than most other games. I hope it works out well, and I hope it's not too much of an undertaking for the team, but we'll workshop that later. More importantly, the bigger uh, contention besides that is, besides the side stuff of making a game, playing a game and the things like that, the biggest uh, other thing I want to announce is that I'm also going to be working on some more story awards, obviously. But I think there's a side of me that wants to go back to working on more of my own personal comics and making, like, properties based off of them. So I think you'll still be seeing a lot more of the sort of ha-ha, funny, let's, uh, let's play YouTubers. But I think some of them will also still just be now uh, me putting my own characters into them because I want to start exploring their like personalities and stuff. One project that's about to come up here, uh, or one project I'll hopefully be able to finally release here soon is a big presentation of like all the characters for a comic of mine that I've been working on since I was in high school. It's like 10, it's like 15 years in the running at this point. It's nuts. But, um... In any case, I, I guess the best way is I'm still here doing work. I just haven't uploaded everything in a while. Actually, I thought it would be kind of funny if um, when I upload this video, I'll actually just go ahead and upload everything. I actually got today off from work. So, um, little snow day out here in Colorado. So, essentially, um, once this video goes up, relatively, you should be seeing the following going online. Besides me having to maybe edit a few things but to be honest i'll probably just uphold this fully unscripted but basically you will fully see the following go up one a bunch of or sorry one a bunch of uh posts on my instagram that will have um all the new comic book pages uploaded i think we're expecting 10 pages for zenzo legend and five sorry five for magi circle the new redo uh comic series um, the second thing you'll see is those two animatics going up on the project or on the YouTube channel. So that'll be great. Three, a couple of concept uh, art for characters designs on both Instagram and also the Deviant art. Um, and I think the last fourth big one, I guess, is just I'm working on a video game of my own. I don't know if that'll actually go anywhere too far, but. 
I've put so much work into it now. I, I at least want to get to a demo, and then if it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. But uh, I hope the demo at least gets rot. So, yeah. Damn, unscripted me sounds so fucking weird sometimes. I, I <laughs> Also, it's kind of funny, too, that since this is unscripted, because A, not only can you see my bed behind me, but also B, um, besides being Christmas-themed with my new red scarf for Christmas and then my classic green hoodie that I've had for so fucking long, the hair is going to be a little weird because I... No joke, this is like... The, I've been working on things so hard. This is the first time my beard has gotten, like, this thick. Like, seriously, I've always kept, like, a semi shaved down sort of like semi trim peach fuzz kind of thing but no this is like full blown uh man beard now so it's nuts all right well i mean that's about it that's the update i wanted to give you guys just want to let you know that i'm still alive kicking doing work um and besides that i guess just i'll announce things when they come up but just be expecting some content here real soon and when i mean real soon i mean like Literally, in a couple of minutes. Bye-bye!